The voice acting in Shampoo is so great. Also, it took me the entire segment to realise the play on the word shampoo there. This is the first segment of the second episode of the third season of The New Adventures of Winnie the Pooh. And the unthinkable has happened. Pooh Bear has lost his appetite. He can't eat any honey. So Tigger brings out his private ear character to try and solve the problem. And it's deduced that Pooh Bear may not actually be Pooh Bear. And the characters start to think that maybe none of them are who they think they are. And this means that the voice actors start to speak like other characters, but in their characters' voices. For example, if I've written this down correctly, Rabbit starts to act and speak like Piglet. Piglet starts to speak like Gopher, which is particularly impressive. Uh, I think John Fiddler uh, did an amazing job of, of getting the intonations uh, of Gopher, but with Piglet's accent or, or Piglet's voice um, in particular. That was impressive. Owl started to talk like Pooh. Gopher started to talk like Owl. And it was just so cleverly done and so fascinating. Now, the actual looking for the appetite part of the narrative isn't that interesting. It's kind of flat and not that well developed. But because because we have these really interesting character changes, I'm totally okay with that. I found this to be one of the most fascinating because it was just so great to see the well to hear the talent in that voice acting. It must be difficult to talk in your character's voice while mimicking another character's intonations and Everybody did such an amazing job of it. And of course, it was well animated like that. For example, we have Rabbit looking quite timorous and Piglet um, is quite, well, I, I, how would you describe Gopher? I don't want to say overconfident, but Gopher definitely has a very, let's get this done, takes no rubbish attitude. And Piglet really had a good way of showing that. And it was very well animated, very well voice acted, absolutely very well voice acted. But yeah, the actual Pooh's missing appetite. I think this is one of those episodes where Christopher Robin really should have been in it. Whenever the characters have a something complicated they have to learn about, Christopher Robin comes along and explains things. And it makes it easier for the viewer to understand. And I think it would have been good if Christopher Robin came along and explained Pooh's lack of appetite. I also think maybe maybe there should have been a reason for the lack of appetite, such as he was anxious about something or, you know, he was feeling unwell. I, I don't know. But it, it, if it had been something children could relate to, then I think it might have been more beneficial. But again, because we have this great voice acting and these different character traits... I still found it to be really fascinating. Shampoo may not be the best written episode, but it's certainly one of the best voice acted. And I have to say, maybe on paper it sounds like it could have been a bit better, but I still really enjoyed it.